सो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस दिस प्रीवियस ईयर क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम द थर्मोडाइनमिक्स फ्रॉम द गेट एग्जाम विच वॉज आस्ट इन दर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी दिस क्वेश्चन वॉज आस्ट फॉर वन मार्क्स Why we are discussing this question is because uh, there are lot of doubts related to this question. So we'll try to clear all those doubts. Now uh, let me just uh, go through the situation. What is given here? So what we have is we have a vessel that is a closed vessel that is given in the problem, and the closed vessel is at twenty five degrees Celsius. Closed vessel contains water and water vapor. Now there is only water vapor. so the total pressure will be the saturation pressure so whatever will be the total pressure here inside the vessel uh, because there is no other gases involved see if you see the atmospheric air uh, let us say 25 degree celsius so total pressure will be one atmosphere even though the partial pressure the contribution of the pressure of water vapor uh, is very very less at that condition but if there is only water vapor so whatever is the pressure of the water vapor that will be the total pressure because there are no other gases so here they have not said that there are uh, there is air present here they have said there is water vapor so there is the vapor of h2o now if we have h2o vapor and as well as liquid present at that condition so that is the uh, condition where the liquid is in the saturated liquid condition and vapor is in the saturated vapor condition corresponding to 25 degree celsius the vapor pressure is very low i remember the values for solving this question you need not know the values so let me show you here on the ts diagram which i have drawn here is 25 degree celsius let us say we are at condition 1 where we have uh, some saturated liquid and some saturated vapor and the pressure is 3.17 kilo pascal which is very low compared to the atmospheric pressure of 101.325 kilo pascal right now what we are doing is we have to keep this in an oven now the oven is given to be isothermal that means the temperature of the oven is not changing inside the oven temperature is 80 degree celsius that is maintained and the pressure of air in the atmosphere i mean the atmosphere of the oven is one atmosphere so uh, this vessel is closed so it is not directly impacted by the pressure here but because it is 80 degree celsius the oven the uh water vapor and the water mixture will eventually reach 80 degree celsius temperature so once they reach 80 degree celsius temperature again what they have shown here is some water and they have shown some vapor so we will again have some water and some vapor right so uh again the condition here will be some saturated liquid and saturated water vapor what is the pressure of the water vapor in saturation condition at 80 degree celsius obviously even if you don't know it is less than what it will be for 100 degree celsius so now the 100 degree celsius we know the saturation pressure for 100 degree celsius the saturation pressure of water vapor is one atmosphere that is 101.325 kilo pascal right so uh, when you heat the water up to 100 degree celsius it becomes saturated liquid that means the liquid will start converting into vapor so uh the saturation pressure of liquid as well as the water vapor above the liquid will be one atmosphere when the temperature is 100 but if the temperature is below 100 like in this case it is 80 degree celsius the pressure of saturated liquid as well as the saturated vapor will be below one atmosphere that is you need not remember the values i have written for your reference it is around 47 kilo pascal which is much less than one atmosphere now this is the pressure inside the vessel and if you open the valve because the surrounding air pressure is one atmosphere what will happen is suddenly the surrounding air will start entering the vessel as soon as you open the valve fine so if we have to find out the answer for this question the answer will be a the hot air will go inside the vessel through valve a fine so this will be our answer i'm just showing you this uh for your reference the discussion we have done fine yes and i have shown the pv diagram here pv diagram is just for our reference pressure specific volume diagram that means the vessel is same so the mass total mass in the vessel will remain constant see here what is specific volume it is total volume upon total mass so when the vessel was here or it is here the total mass of liquid plus vapor is constant the total volume of the vessel is constant so specific volume will remain constant so i have shown the condition changing from 1 to 2 
on the PV diagram also. Fine. All these details are not necessary just for understanding the situation we have drawn it. Fine. So, this is the solution here.